Did you know that all your messages, emails and notifications on your phone can be spied on by app developers and phone manufacturers? This means SMS on your phone, messages on WhatsApp and Messenger and emails from Gmail can be viewed by app developers because many apps on your phone have direct access to messages. The problem is often our messages contain personal data like bank information or ID details. That's why in today's video I'll show you the setting to change so only you can read your messages on your phone. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and let's dive in. So that each of us can find the settings on your phone, I will show the settings on two phones. Let's start with this one. On this phone head to main settings. After this scroll all the way down and tap on apps. Then in the upper right hand corner of the screen tap on three dots. And you can see special access. Tap on that. After this scroll down a little bit and tap on notification access. And on this phone head to main settings 2. Then scroll down a little bit and tap on privacy protection. After this tap on special permissions. Then scroll down a little bit and tap on device and app notifications. If you couldn't find the settings the way I showed, try using the search in the settings. Head to main settings on your phone and tap on search. Tap on search. After this type special. And here you can find special access or special permissions. Tap on that. Here we see a list of applications that have access to all our notifications. This means they can read all our SMS messages, emails and so on. Even the phone itself warns us about this. For instance, if I want to give this permission for some application, tap here, I will see such message from my phone. Read and control notifications is highly sensitive permission. If you grant this permission, your private information might be leaked and your property might be at risk. Here's what apps will be allowed to do. Read all SMS, including financial and account info, read notifications from instant messages and read all notifications, including notifications from social media and banking apps. So what should to do? Look through the list of applications that have access to all your notifications. Remove any access for those applications that shouldn't have it. For instance, I leave only the Android Auto application. Because if you are driving and connect your phone to the car, it needs notification access to inform you about new messages. If you're unsure whether an app should have this permission, search its name on Google to understand its function and necessity for notifications. Pay special attention to apps you've installed yourself, since not all applications are honest and safe. Don't worry if you disable access to notifications for some application that needs this access to work, because such an application will simply ask you to enable access later and you will then decide whether to give access to notifications or not. And now I'll show you one application that you definitely need to disable in the settings. This app monitors everything you do on your phone, sends it to developers and drains the battery faster. It's not available on all phones, but if you have it, disable it in two places. Tap back in the upper left hand corner of the screen. After this scroll down and tap on usage access. And here you can see application analytics. Tap on that and turn this off. After this tap back in the upper left hand corner of the screen. Tap back again. Scroll all the way up and you need find modify system settings. Tap on that and tap on this application again analytics and turn this off. Is this video helpful? Like this video and thank you for watching.